up, what's up? Hey, howdy, hey. Alright, we're back. So, I have taken the gimbal and put it up. We do not have the gimbal out. Because that's very obvious. Um, so, you can see there's probably about 12 people in line now. So, the 12 people are in line. There's a lot of cars of people sitting here parked. So, what's up, what's up? Crews are here. They have arrived. Oh, I don't want anything. I'm not buying anything. No, no, no. Absolutely not. But we have followed this story so closely for so long, and this is not far from my house. I drove over here. I probably, I, well, we'll see at 12 o'clock what happens. So, 12 o'clock is what time the doors open and you can register and get your number. And then you can look around, I guess. And then at four is when the auction starts. I'm not buying anything. Oh, I ended the live, that's why. So again, good morning, or good afternoon, welcome. If we haven't met, my name's Corey. I am a local to Savannah, Georgia, and we go on morning walks. We take a, we took a little field trip today. Not far from Savannah. I'll get them for you, Trey, and bring them by. I wouldn't get you a um, cinnamon roll, but I'll get you some monogram pillows. But today is the Mazelle estate auction so if you've been following the murdochs at all this is theirs oh yeah it was chaos this morning <laughs> so if you've never followed me be sure to hit that follow button i am a little surprised i kind of thought more people would be in line by now so 12 o'clock and 30 minutes is when supposedly the doors are opening to register So if you've never followed me, I do go live seven days a week on a morning walk and I bring you guys along. This is Liberty Auction. Liberty Auction is, you can go on their Facebook and see what all is being auctioned off and their website. Now, typically, I would say typically they um, have auctions every Thursday. A train for 80. Um, now, I will say I've seen South Carolina. I've seen Florida. I've seen West Virginia tag so far. So, yeah. I've seen those thus far. They do have the Royal Restroom Porta Potty set up. Yeah, meanwhile, Alex chilling out. So yeah, we're just kind of hanging out. Again, this is in Pembroke, Georgia. About 30 minutes from Savannah. Not far. And today is the auction for Mazelle, which is the Murdoch family home. All the items that were in that house are in that building right now. And they're going to be auctioned off. Even the cars are going to be auctioned off. Auctions for the cars start at like 5 p.m. today. Well, you would actually be surprised, especially if you're an antique collector. They have a ton of antiques. But see, I'm watching for 
see my thing why i'm not in line and kind of standing here watching as people pull up is in order to bid you have to be in person you cannot be you can't bid online you can't bid over the phone you have to be here in person so it makes you kind of wonder who's being sent no definitely not i will not be live for the um, auction i may register i will say this i may register for a number just to go inside to see it because a lot of you have asked um the money goes to a lot of the victims and a lot of the people that are owed the money yep we are super close to thirty-seven thousand. again this was not a far drive y'all this is not far from here it is very surreal. It's kind of like that day we were at the courthouse and he dro they drove up and he walked in and that weird vibe is the same. This is at Liberty Auction. It is a very random place, yeah. I mean, so they were the auction company that was hired to... Uh, go into Mazelle, they had to clean it out and bring all the things here. So it starts at four, however at 12, the doors open and you get your number. And then I guess you can preview. At four o'clock is when people can start auction, like bidding. I don't know if we're gonna be allowed to, but I may go in just to survey and should like be able to give y'all a talk. So yeah, 12 o'clock the doors open. 12 o'clock is when you're supposed to be going in to register. Then, uh, somebody said one o'clock. All I see on their website said 12 o'clock is when you can register. Four o'clock is when auction begins. Oh, yeah. Nope, haven't. Oh, you know they did. You know the auction family. You know the auction, the family probably did. Again, I don't have y'all on the gimbal, so it will be a little shaky due to the fact that we're trying to be incognito. Yeah, I don't think, here's the thing, I don't think family will come. Do I think they may send somebody? 100%. Again, if you've never followed me, hit that follow button. We'll be live for a little while. At least until 12 when the doors are supposed to open. Yeah, no, there's not anybody there. Now, some people could be coming just at 4 o'clock and going to get their ticket and come in. These are what you call the diehards. These people are like hardcore. Nothing right now. It's quiet. I mean, we're just listening and waiting. Now, again, here's the deal. Had this been farther than like 20 minutes from my house, 30 minutes from my house, I wouldn't have drove over here, but it was so close, so it was kind of like I needed to. I just had to for you guys, because a lot of you wanted to see. So this is the auction building. So the local stations are here. You've got, these are all Savannah stations. WJCL, that's Savannah, because it's so close. And then you've got WTOC as well. Both of those are here so far. A lot of media will come and cover this. So again, if you've never followed me, welcome. My name's Corey. I'm a local to Savannah that goes live seven days a week. We went on our morning walk this morning. We started about 7.55 and we walked to about almost 9.45. Then I stopped the live to charge my phone and have brought you guys on a little bit of a field trip today. That field trip is 
the Mazelle Family Auction. That auction is taking place for Mazelle. Mazelle is that property that was owned by the Murdochs. And so today is the auction. I will. Yeah, I'm going to. I was live. So at 12 o'clock is when the doors are supposed to open. Well, I would think, here's my thought. Because this has been, anybody with half a brain knows this has been huge coverage. Social media coverage, media coverage, everything. I would think that if you couldn't at least have cameras in the inside, that you, there would be signs on the door. Because that's the door everybody's going in. I'm not a newscaster. This is Eastern time, yep. It is fun. Is that as heavy as it looks? Yes. Okay. I just want to confirm that. <laughs> it's about 35 pounds. Oh my word. Woo. So again, remember, when we go on field trips like this, you must behave, guys. Oh, I've heard. I've got a bag. Y'all don't worry. Y'all just got to behave. Okay. Well, we'll see. It is hot, though. That sun is blaring. So the news crews are getting here. <laughs> Hold on, I got a light. All right, so again, I don't have y'all on the gimbal because it's just, I'm not going to be that obvious, right? This is where the auction is taking place for the Murdoch estate, Mazelle. It is really sunny, so I cannot see chat at all. So moderators, I am really counting on you guys right now. So if that bathroom set up. There's a nice breeze. They've roped off parking all the way back here. You can, so it's Liberty Auction. You can go on their Facebook page or you can go online and see what all is being auctioned off. 12 o'clock is what time the doors are supposed to open. Their website is libertyauction.net. Oh, it's okay, Jen. Don't stress. Oh, you're right. So here's all the cars and trucks that are being auctioned. Wow, I didn't even see that. I wasn't even paying attention. So these are the cars that are being auctioned. There's the cars. That's kind of wild, isn't it? That's at five o'clock when you can aux you can bid on these cars. Oh, one hundred percent. I agree. They will sell higher. So here are the cars. Yep, some of them are, guys.
Yeah, lots of rains. Bless you if that were you. <laughs> Bless you. Mm-hmm. So yeah, if you head on to let's go get one. If you head into the um, website libertyauction.net you'll see all their stuff. See, I don't think they can put cameras in. I know, I gotta find the feeder. We gotta find the feeders, y'all. So again, if you're just joining, hello, hello, hello. This is the auction for Mazelle, which is the property that um, the Murdoch's own that just sold this week. So the auction starts today, 12 o'clock, they're opening the doors to register. Then I guess you can look around. And then at four o'clock is when the auction begins. And I was just telling the guy, bless you. So they are auctioning cars off. It's starting at five o'clock, it's those five. Starting with that white, nice car. So if you've never hit that follow, it is 1141. I am kind of surprised there's not as many people in line. I'm kind of watching to see because you have to be here in person to bid. To um, bid on anything it is not online. It is not. You can't do it online. You can't call in. You have to be in person. So, which means I'm guessing people are going to send other people. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah, citizen high to citizen low. Who oh, no, not Mono. I think people come because the story has been so big. I think people come. Nope, you have to be here in person. And they were very clear. Oh my gosh, absolutely, that would be great. Could you imagine? Yes, baby. Some people are just mesmerized by the story. That's all. Nope. Bank owned. So they have to auction off. But you're going to have a lot of people here who are for the hunting. I mean, they have some, if you're into hunting, they've got some crazy hunting gears. It is sad. No, absolutely. All this debt off so he can legally nope money's not going to his son thank you girlfriend money's going to people who um, they owed the debt to no, not that I've seen. I would have been nervous. I'm so bad at public speaking. You are not bad at it. And they'll edit it for like 30 seconds. She'll be good. Oh, we should find out what channel she is. Um, that's WJCL. What is WJCL? Uh, local Savannah Station. Local Savannah Station. Thank you. You're welcome. It's your family. I found a dentist in my life. You, baby. Do you have your eyes on anything in particular or option today? Thank you for taking the picture. My family just died. I got my picture with Nancy Grace. 
Oh, wasn't that cool? I got my picture. She's so nice. She yes, ma'am. So nice. She was very, You're not very nice. Are you? No. But wouldn't that, wasn't that funny that, you know, how nice, like, people, because she gets a bad rap. I know. She was, she was so I've nice. Never, I've never, I'm not that, I'm not so familiar. Nice. Like, yeah. I know who she is, mm -hmm. but I've never really sat down and. Yeah, she was incredible. She was. She was there. And she just sat there like, hey, what's, you know. It was an adventure. Where are y'all from? Virginia. Y did y'all drive in today? No, yesterday. Okay. At a hotel. <laughs> wow. There are not a lot of hotels around here. Is there? No, nope. there's really not. Uh, Statesboro. Statesboro. You, played, you stayed, I was going to say, closest we've been to Statesboro. Yeah, yeah, I did a whole map thing. I won't complain about my 20 minutes. So. I was going to say, we tried to stay on base, but there, were, there was no lodging on oh, yeah. available. Wow, that's awesome. No, it's in Georgia, in Pembroke, Georgia. I like Georgia. It's so pretty here. It is. It's great. It was so neat to drive into Savannah down off 95. Mm -hmm. oh, this is not. Come to Charleston. I've been to Charleston. Oh, yeah. I've been mm -hmm. to Charleston. Um, we love Savannah. I mean, I love I'm, Savannah. I'm from here, there, so I mean, I, I love do. it. But I love to go to Savannah. But it's good to be in Charleston. That way, you get to go to Savannah. For, uh -huh. It's not far. Yeah. Do both. So how's this work, y'all? Got it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just here. We just register. Then, yeah, I know. They don't start until what? Four. four. But do you get to preview? Oh, at one. Mm -hmm. One. Yeah, you do. You should get to preview at normal. Oh, wouldn't this be at normal options? You get to preview. Yeah, so I would. I've never been to an auction. I haven't either. This is what my I followers have. are telling me right now. On my are you TikTok. on the internet? I am. I have a TikTok for Savannah. I have like thirty-six thousand, almost thirty-seven thousand wow. followers. Yeah. What do you uh, TikTok about? It's a day in the life of my life. I was a teacher who left education. Me too. Oh, there you go. Oh wow! And so I go on a morning walk. I've lost one hundred and nineteen pounds. Well, congratulations! Thank wow. you. And I just share Savannah. People love Savannah. Yeah, it's a great little town. So we just walk and talk, and they've been captivated by this trial. So one day we went up to the courthouse. It was actually the day before the verdict came in. So that was interesting. Just a little bit of planning ahead. Oh. Uh, so how much cash is in the car? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, so 12 o'clock is when the doors are supposed to open. So what did you teach? Um, I taught middle grades, language arts, and then I also did special education. I did special ed. There you go. That's all I ever did for 35 yeah. years. Bless you. I lasted 15. Well, I just kept going. I didn't really have a choice. I hear you. I hear you. I'd already put too much into it. I was going to say at 35. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I had some things in my life I had to keep going. I don't blame you. Had I had a few more years in, I probably would have been like, you know what, I'm just going to ride it out. But I was at 15, and I was like, that's a... Yeah, well, that's a... That wasn't I have to make the decision. Late. I gotta, Yeah, that wasn't too Either late. or. I kept thinking and thinking about it, but boy, mm -hmm. it was a hard life. I figured, like, once you're over 20, you're stuck till... It was a hard life. Uh, and it has progressively gotten... I still talk to teacher friends all the time, and they just hear the horror stories. Every time I see a school bus, I just like, I know. No more bus duty. Or like that, for, I know, that, the bus duty. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No oh, yeah. lunch, you know, yep. no bathroom break. Oh, yeah, nothing. all the things. I agree. Excuse <laughs> me. Hi, my name is Max. What's up? Uh, coming from Atlanta. I was wondering, could I chat with you regarding sure. this upcoming auction? Sure. Awesome. I don't know much, but I will answer whatever you sure. want. Sure. We're at from Atlanta. What are y'all? I used to live in Atlanta in Conyers. Sure. Uh, we'll see you. Oh, cool. Awesome.
Are y'all really moving to CNN station? Yes. That is happening. I heard that. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's my opinion no, of knowledge no, right no. now. Oh, okay. <laughs> you found about as the same amount of knowledge as awesome. me too. Because we're all like, what? Um, all right, so could you please tell me your name and could you spell it out for yeah. us, please? It's Corey, K O R R I, Ray, R A Y. And uh, you, just so I'll make sure I'm getting this right. Um, do you do anything? What do you do? Yeah, I'm from Savannah, so not far from here, like 30 minutes. And I actually, I stream. I'm a content creator for TikTok. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. So, um, why are you here in front of the auction house well, today? This case has mesmerized and captivated everybody. I mean, it's the biggest story on social media, on the news, everywhere. And everybody's just intrigued by the Murdochs, the case that we got to go up to the courthouse the day before the verdict came in. So that was really cool. And um, my followers have just been so intrigued by all of this. So we came over. It wasn't far from home. So it was not even a 30-minute drive to come up and see what's going on and see kind of what's available and you know, to see farther into their life, to see what comes from somebody's home, you really get to see the inner webs of who they were as people. Yes, I do have some. So you said you've been following the trial for a long time. What were your thoughts on the trial and eventually the outcome as well? I think that there's still a lot of answers that haven't been given to the story. And I think it's going to, being from here, the Murdoch family has always been a name you've heard. Um, growing up, I grew up in Savannah, and so it's always been a name we've heard for decades. So it wasn't a surprise by any means that it was front page newspaper stories. Um, so I think more is still going to come out with the story. I don't think it's completely done yet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, have you got your eyes on anything in particular today? The teacher in me, I'm a former teacher, the teacher in me is intrigued by the card catalog. There's a card catalog and it just brings back all these teaching memories. And so that's the one thing I'm like, that's really cool to see. <laughs> And will you be doing any streaming for your TikTok followers? So if I can, I will. Um, I don't know if they're going to allow streaming and what you get inside, but that's what I'll, they're all hoping for on here. Okay. Okay. Do you have a spending limit today? Um, I don't know. If I <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. Okay. And um, I guess how do you how do you feel about the fact that? They're selling these pieces from the Moselle estate. How do you, what do you feel about that? You know, it's extremely sad to me. This is a family that had it all. Like, finance, wealth, knowledge, everything. They had the world at their fingertips. So it's like the citizen high, the citizen low. To see some of their most prized possessions, I know that Maggie's monogram pillows are in there. And to me, that is so sad that someone's monogram pillows are being auctioned off. You know, and it's the memories of what's inside that I think is probably the saddest, too you know this family at one point maybe was really really happy and then this happened so it, i have a lot of emotional thoughts when it comes to this auction that all their items are just being auctioned off yeah i mean in particular there is that sofa that mm -hmm. hypothetically considering the different statements from different people that that was the couch that murdoch had a nap on how do, you, yep. how do you feel about seeing that that is you know and there's pictures on maggie's social media of her and her family sitting on the couch there's two um Christmas decorations that the boys have a picture in front of on their social media. So it's that that, you know, you go, these were real people, despite their social media frenzy that we all have right now, or the TV news frenzy, these were real people with real stories and real memories. And so that, that's something I take going into this. Will I buy anything? I don't know, but it is interesting to see what was on the inside. Is there anything I haven't asked that you would want people to know about? No, you're good. No? Just yeah. out of curiosity, where can you be found on TikTok? It's called A Day in the Life of Corey. So, A Day in the Life of K-O-R-R-I. Okay. Yeah. have almost 37,000 followers, so we're growing by the minute. Very nice. Yeah. Hopefully even more with this. Yeah, this has brought a lot of attention. <laughs> a lot. So. Do you feel like you get particular, like, only hardcore Murdoch followers uh, who are no. interested? Well, or? it's kind of a cross. I get people who are intrigued by the story, who know the story. I have people that are like, 
what are you doing? Like, what's going on? What is this family? And then you have people who are not from the South who don't understand the good old boy system, the what has played out, which growing up here, it's a true thing. And so people are like, what do you mean this family had that much power and that much control? So I get a little bit of everything, but you know, being at the courthouse, seeing Alex come in each, that was impactful. That was something where people were like, this is a real story. This is really more than what we're seeing on social media. Yeah. Awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so much for your time. Good luck on your move. That was pretty crazy. That was CNN. That's a national sh channel. Holy cow. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. That was pretty wild. Yeah, so we, that was CNN. That was a pretty big channel. Yes. 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 Thank you. One little thread of carpet. Yeah, that was pretty. I'll have to, if anybody happens to see it on CNN, y'all are going to have to send it to me. Like in Pompeii, I got a little rock. And the guy said, I saw you do that. But he just said, I said, I mean, who? If everybody did that, they'd be nothing. I bet they were placing carpet. I do love the people that come in and say, I'm nosy, but yet they're sitting in my live watching this play out. That's cute. Thanks for the Thanks for the kite I'm nosy But you come in and you're going to tell me I'm nosy as AF But yet you're in my live watching my live Okay 12 o'clock So 12 o'clock is what time you can register so if you missed it, I just got interviewed by CNN. And they asked what my TikTok name was. What the heck? So this is the auction for the Mazelle, which is the Murdoch family home. Mazelle was the big house with all the property. And so their items were cleared out by this company. And this company is auctioning them off today. And the pre yeah, proceeds should be going to pay all the debt. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I'm not, I don't think I'm buying anything. Honestly. No, it was bank owned. So the bank sold it for $3.7 million. Uh -huh. So that was kind of funny. That was a long interview. <laughs> that was a long interview, I'll tell you that. They did, and that was something I wanted WSAV was what y'all got interviewed by. WSAV. So they have, go on Facebook, because what they'll do is they'll do, okay, go on their website, um, because what they'll do is they'll do, if they interviewed you, they're going to do the camera version of it, and then they type it out, so you'll have a printed argue, um, article as well. Yep, that's too, typically how they do their stories here. And I'm sure they're pushing for the 5 o'clock news, is what they're probably aiming to do it. Mm-hmm. It'll be interesting. I mean, now, I didn't lie when I said what item am I looking for. Well, the item I was looking for, that, y'all know that card catalog. Liberty Auction is the name of the auction company. Nobody really Oh, yeah, that's way more. 
buy a piece of paper to hang on the wall. Okay. I, I don't yeah, I want to. Oh, yeah, Trey wants me to look at the turtles and the jumpsuits. So I think you go in and register, and then I think at one o'clock is when you're allowed to look around. I support anything. Nope, you cannot bid online. You have to be here in person to bid. Yeah, that's for about 530000 I would say maybe about thirty at most. Not a lot. The auction itself isn't until 4 o'clock. Nope, this is in actually Pembroke, Georgia, which is not 30 minutes from Savannah. So you're from the Yes, ma'am. So would you recommend anywhere near here for like lunch or dinner or something local? There's a little place. Right yeah, there's a little place. I don't know anything it about it, but it is right what down is the street. What's a traditional like like something we could only like do in it's Georgia? It's all in Savannah. What are you so I don't know if you want to drive. Well, I mean, it depends on if you want to drive all the way to Savannah. Oh, we have. That's been. the thing. Who would you recommend in Savannah? I guess it depends uh, on how tired we are. Yeah, how, how tired you are. What kind of food oh, you want? I mean, if you go to the historic yeah, district, district, you've got Lady and Sons. You've got Spanky's. Um, I mean, you got Spanky's. You got Hitch. So if you need a good drink after all of this, I'm gonna still be here till ten o'clock tonight. What you talking about? There's a little place up here on the right. Yeah, there is that little place. Little home place. Yeah, because there's nothing in this general vicinity. How do I get on your TikTok? Do I think you have to add the app first. Yes, ma'am. Oh yes, ma'am. Here. Let's see. Where's your app? I feel sure I got it. Where's your app store? Wait, let's go back this way. I feel sure I've got it though, because I I don't really know how to do it. I just go down and look at little blurbs. Oh, that's of what I do. So I do have those little blurbs of things. Mm -hmm. I figured you could find it right fast. Right? I'm looking. I don't see it. Oh, right here. Let's type it in. This will help us. Okay. Oh, there it is. All right. Now, what do I do to get you? Okay. Do you have an account on TikTok? I think so. Okay. So, is it, if you have Google, you can click there. So, you okay, have to get logged Google. in. Oh, God. All of that. Well, tell me where. It's what a I day want. in the life of Corey is my username. Wait, I may have a sticker that I can give you with my name on it. Let's see. I think I may have a sticker. Oh, I do. I have a sticker with my name oh, on it. Good. Yeah, I'll follow you. Yeah. See what you're doing, next teacher. Yes, ma'am. You're still, you're still with us. I am. Is that? A, is that well, a, here I'll give you this one. Yep. Here you go. So that's my username. It's a okay. day in the life of Corey. Got it. That's yeah. Perfect. I'm glad I got it because it's. There you go. Yes, ma'am. It is. But I go live every morning walking historic Savannah. Oh, okay. So. I go there. We go there a pretty good bit. He has a time share. Oh, that's awesome. So we have to go there, and it's really nice. It's right nearby the square. Oh, yeah. It's beautiful down there. That's awesome. <laughs> so 12 o'clock, it should have opened to register. I know that I hit 37,000. We will dance as soon as it. Find a bathroom. Those are great bathrooms right there. They haven't unlocked them yet? Oh, that's cool. You'll be here at three. Yep, over 500,000. Yeah, we're definitely not doing that. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's an estate sale. You are correct. Again, guys, share. thank you for all that you're doing to help moderators in the chat.
has been an eventful morning. We got interviewed by CNN. That was fun. It was nice and white in there. I've been in there a few days. Um, I don't know if I'll still be here, honestly, to tell you the truth. Hey, Blaine, take a slap. I thought I'm going to have time to read. We figured I'd be out here sitting somewhere on the ground. You know the EAB is? I don't think so. I don't think they will. One of the qualifications. Here, put it in my backpack. Put it in the back. Put it in the There's definitely more people getting in line. Just a thought. Yeah, that's pretty crazy, huh? <laughs> Yep, their dynasty has fallen. Uh, they're in there. There's a bunch in there. So I have my driver's. They might need a credit card too. Yeah. I need my. Well, then it's not really gonna matter because all my. Twelve o'clock was what time the doors were supposed to open, and then one o'clock you are supposed to be able to look around. Four o'clock is the actual auction. We may go in. We're not going to stay until 4, I can tell you that. Oh, here you go. At least the weather's good today. Yeah, it's beautiful. We're ready for the things this wanna. Oh, yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah, uh, I was surprised how clean it was down here. Oh, yeah. It still sticks in Virginia. Oh. Camera crews are going in, so we're going in, folks. No, I'm not. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like there's a state up there. This city is this area is not used to this this attention. This, no. Well their website said they got a couple hundred they usually have a couple hundred people at auction every. Yeah. It is. Really this is a cool shop. Mm-hmm. We will walk around. First, we have to register. And the selfies have begun. People are taking selfies of the couch. I will not take a selfie with the couch. There's just a limit. See, I don't know if I'm actually going to bid on anything. So I'm just going like, I'm going to walk around and then get back in line and just saw uh, I think I'm just gonna walk around. Right, I'll I'll think, oh, you're sweet. Thank you. <laughs> so they're letting people walk around. So we're gonna walk around, you guys. They took the pillows. Y'all, that's what I want is that card catalog. I don't have you on the gimbal because it's just too much to try to do. There's a card catalog, y'all. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm letting you guys just kind of see. We're not staying till 4. 
Mm -hmm. We're going to walk around. We're going to look. Again, if you're just joining me, good morning my, or good afternoon. My name is Corey. I am a local to Savannah. We go on morning walks each morning. However, we took a little detour this afternoon. This is the auction for the Murdoch House Mazelle. This is the property that Mazelle was the Murdoch home and they are auctioning off all of the stuff. It will be spotty. Well, it's a seven bedroom house. Yep. Mm -hmm. So much stuff. Again, this is the auction. I didn't think they were gonna let people in until one, like to look around, but they're not stopping people from looking. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I'm not bidding on anything. But this is the couch. They've taken the pillows away, though. But this is the couch. I know if the couch could talk. I mean, this supposedly is the couch that Alex Murdoch took his nap on that night. Um, it's my understanding it's being sold. I heard it's being used as a, um, I heard it's being used as a VRBO. I'm going here. Let's go see the turtles. So it is not as chaotic. Oh, look, y'all. It's like the fur coats and leather jackets. Nope, it is not an on leather jacket. Nope, it is not an online auction. You have to be here in person to bid. This is pretty wild. I will tell you this. It is surreal to look at what was on the inside of their homes, right? Look, it's the turtle shells. Y'all, they don't have just two of the turtle lamps. They have multiple turtle lamps. They look real to me. It is weird. Oh, I'm sure they're real. Yeah. Yeah, I'm most confident. <laughs> I'm not bidding on anything, you guys. I'm here just looking. It is very sad. You went from Citizen High to Citizen Low, right? These were in, there are pictures with Maggie of these. So these are actual, there's pictures on Maggie's Facebook, which they have not taken down, of those lamps, of that couch. Let's go in the other room, okay? It's pretty crazy, huh? Mm -hmm. I don't, two dog beds. wonder if they owned for the dogs. Yeah. They were hunters. I mean, that was a, their lifestyle. Let's go in the other room. There's really not a long line. Yeah. 
Hi, how are, how are you? you? So the locals are like, we didn't know the news would be here. This is way here. Like, they're here in full forces. How are you? Yeah, all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. Again, y'all, chat is moving so quickly. I can't, I definitely can't answer a lot of the chat. There is a, now this, this, I will tell you these hit differently. There is a picture on Maggie's page of the boys sitting in front of these tent, these soldiers. Well, if it's sick now, you don't have to be here. I don't know, honestly. I'm just looking. I have, y'all, there are two massive rooms of stuff. We are moving through. Bidding, auctioning starts at four. I'm not bidding for anybody. I won't be here when bidding actually begins. I just wanted to come. No, I don't. Yeah, the dogs, um, the maid has one of them, and I think the family has the other. So if you're just joining me, I have turned it to a subscriber only chat because chat's going way too quickly for me to even remotely contend with right now or my moderators. If you are just joining, this is the auction for Mazelle, which was the Murdoch family home. All the items were cleared out and now they will be auctioned off starting at four o'clock today. If you've never followed me, hit that follow button. Yeah. So we have we have turned on subscriber only chat because we are at 1,700 people in the live right now. So we are doing subscriber only right now just look and you will see all the items I will walk you back through I will definitely be making videos of the infamous couch that is all over the place Oh, look at the Radiate record player. <laughs> and
interesting book titles. Crisis of Characters. Lots of James Patterson. Cookbooks. So that hits different. Look at the cookbooks that are tabbed. Again, if you are new to this live, welcome. My name's Corey. I am a local to Savannah, Georgia. I do go live seven days a week and I bring you guys along. It's the bike, y'all. Y'all remember the bicycle in the pictures? Genevieve, you in here? Y'all remember the bicycle in the front of the house that everybody was having a fit about how long that bike sat there? There's the bike. There's the infamous bike that sat outside Mazelle from the day the crime happened. Thanks for the subscription. I will sing and dance when we leave here. But there's the... There's the bike. We will walk back through again. Promise you, we're gonna walk back through the other side. I just wanna show you this area. So again, welcome, welcome. So if you're new here, my name's Corey. I am a local to Savannah. I go live seven mornings a week on a morning walk. We took a little bit of a detour today. This is the auction for the Murdoch family. But that's what it should be. for the subscription absolute power corrupts absolutely it's a very strong saying let's go back in the other room so again if you've never followed me welcome You haven't followed me. We are at the auction for the Mazelles. Apparently, 335, the number 335 is all Murdoch stuff. Interesting. So 335 means it was owned by the Murdochs. It is surreal to see it in, isn't it? Do you see the bicycle? Do you see the bicycle? You know the bicycle that was in the front of the house that everybody had a hoopla about? Over there. It's the green bicycle that sat in front of the house forever and everybody was like, there's a bike sitting there. I know. I was like, oh. Where are you in from? Are you local? Savannah. Yeah, okay. I'm from Savannah. I got you. Yep. Okay, so that's really weird. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> so, I mean, you know, at the end of the day, the newscasters are like, wow, this is crazy. Oh, I'll show you something right now in just a second. When they move, I want to let them get their footage. Yeah, the dead bushes. So if it says 3-35, that was owned by the Murdochs.
Thanks for the subscription, guys. Are you a shopper? I'm a TikToker. Oh, a TikToker. Yeah. Nice. So I'm just kind of waiting my turn behind you guys. Sorry. Can I, no, get, can I get some video of you? Sure. You get, a, get a video of that? Yeah. I'm just trying to let y'all all get y'all's footage. Go ahead. You take your picture. Okay. Sorry. I just wanted to grab this for real. Uh, That's a popular item right there. It is. At least with the media anyway. All right. So this was all Alex's stuff, it looks like. Let's see. His name is even in there. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. So you can see, like, his name was in this shirt. So I would think all the 2X was his. Did you see this one? Hey, did you see the, where's it at? Where'd it go? One of them has his name in it. Here you go. Shut the front mm -hmm. door. And you know the bicycles over here. You know the bicycle that's in front of the house and everybody had a fit about saying somebody staged it oh, for the tree. It it's over there. See this number right here? 335, I asked. Yep. Yeah, I asked when I got my mm -hmm. number. They yep. said 335 is a hard argument. Yep. That was my first question. Yep. This small town don't know what's hit them. It is surreal, right? It is. business and now pay for picking through your ugly shit at auction. I know. That's weird. Judging you. It's weird. It's very weird. Is that citizen high to citizen low? It's very weird. Mm-hmm. So I am surprised that they have let people just film. I mean, it's full frenzy. Yep. I'll show you in just a minute. Thanks for the subscriptions. I will show you more. It is. It's wild. Yeah, when you see that and you think of that level of, like, he wore this shirt when he went hunting. But I'm going to show you all something else once they... I'm just letting the news, because I know they have a, their deadline for the 5 o'clock news. They're running for their deadline. So, something else had named all of this. Oh, look, there's somebody's name in here. Oh, here's another one. Hold on. There you go. There's another one. So I guess to tell the difference between the boys, they put their names in the... So there's Alex's name. So anything that says 335 is the Murdoch. So all of this is theirs. Oops, sorry. No, you're fine. No problem. Blackout, I know. I'd like I to buy that fan. I know, right? It is roasty in here. It is. It's very sad. No. So all of this was the Murdochs. All of this. So anything that says 335 is part of that estate. It is. It's extremely sad. When you think of the who this family was. Again, I don't have y'all on the gimbal because it's just too chaotic. And I don't want to be like crazy, crazy. So if you've never followed me, hit that follow button. My name's Corey. I am a local to Savannah, Georgia. I go on morning walks and bring you guys along with me. Oh, look at these plates. These are cool. I did turn off chat for everybody due to the fact of 
It was chaos. Oh, here, y'all, look. It's the little car catalog. That's the one I saw that I was like, it was the little car catalog. So again, things that belong to them are now being put up and people are like obsessed with it, right? So all of this was theirs. Yeah, the tab cookbook, that was hard. It was like, if you were with me that day, we went live and we saw Buster and then we saw Alex and like, it was that weird, like, but to see a tap cookbook. Yeah, so if it says 335, it was the Murdochs. You're good. You're fine. No worries. Don't stress. Y'all got a deadline bigger than I do. No, my girlfriend just loves turtles. <laughs> <laughs> the turtles are interesting, yeah, right? I, I don't know that I would want that in my house. What's that saying? Oh, look at that. They're real. They were avid. They were avid hunters. They feel very real. They feel super. But I guess the ones on the lamps apparently. Mm. They look, they look, they look they pretty look very realistic from the back. I mean, there's a, there's a bird bread. Well, they were avid hunters, so I mean. So, yeah, pretty crazy. People get mesmerized by the Murdoch family. They are absolutely, me like, this has been a story that has just captivated everybody for some reason. I don't really know why, but it has. You're fine, you're good. No, this is good stuff. <laughs> I, um, every time I turn around, I see something else in water. I know, it is wild, isn't it? Sorry, we froze up for a minute. Y'all, I think I'm going to end up being on like every news station around because I have been filmed now multiple times. show you some more stuff. I'm trying to keep people out of the lab. So again, if you haven't followed me, my name is Corey. I am a local to Savannah, Georgia. We go live seven days a week and I bring you guys along. We are currently at the auction for Mazelle, which is the Murdoch family home. They have their items up for auction. So I am walking around. Anything that has the label 335 means that this was owned by the Mazelle or owned by the Murdochs. So like 346, Murdoch didn't own that. 335, the Murdochs did own this. Just FYI. Exactly. You work so hard for what? And again, I'm not... <laughs> Like, at the end of the day, this is a tragedy, a horrible, sad story. No, I'm not buying anything, but we have been mesmerized by this whole story. So, yeah, stuff that says 335 are the Murdochs. They do have other things mixed in. So if you've never followed me, I do go live seven days a week. Let's go look at the furniture again. Let's see which parts belong to them and which did not. So this is not Murdoch property, but all of these TVs are. So all of the TVs were owned by the Murdochs because they have the three.
So we're able to kind of see like this bed was not owned by the Murdochs. This was not owned by the Murdochs. This was. This was. Again, thanks for the subscriptions. I will be doing a song and dance when we get out of this crazy place. That was not. Let's see. This wasn't. This was. Thank you for the subscriptions, you guys. Again, in this chaos moment. This bed was owned by the Murdochs right here. Let me kind of back up. So this was one of the beds. Mm -hmm. There is. Lots. We found a cookbook that has tabs, like it's been tabbed. This was, this table was. This was all Murdoch property. I can't believe I'm the only streamer live here. That's hard to believe. This, y'all, I bet these are nice mattresses too. I ain't buying one, but oh man, they got the, y'all, they got the expensive mattresses. Holy moly. So. This was a Murdoch bed. I don't know whose, but I will tell you, it is a very comfy bed. Let's see if those are. You're having a, so all of these beds, all of these were Murdoch beds. Every last one of them. See, so yeah, once you know 335 is their number, this, all of these beds right here. Uh -huh. They had a lot of beds. I mean, even for seven bedrooms, that's a lot of beds. This is pretty. There's a lot. I mean, here's the infamous couch. So that rug was not. But here's some of the couches you've seen. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of beds. Again, I do not have you guys set up in the gimbal. So this was not owned by the Murdochs. Now, my understanding is everything that they have from there that they're selling, that it's there. So this is, this is probably the most famous of the pieces they have due to the fact that there are pictures on Maggie's social media that show that. You found the couch. I gotta get on this couch. Everybody else is. One, two, three, one. Let me get a better angle. Yeah. One, two. No, me neither. I did it. Yes. Is where that couch right there, based on his testimony, that couch is the couch he napped on that night. That it happened. I mean. Oh yeah, selfies galore. But yeah, so if you believe what the testimony said, he sat there and he slept that night that his wife and son were unalive. I'm trying to keep people out of it. 
So yeah, if you believe that story. It's pretty surreal. Again, I do not have you guys set up on a gimbal. That's why you're so rocky. Because I didn't know what they were going to allow. So I didn't want to cause kind of a chaos or a disruption. Again, we're on a hunt for 335. 335 is the Murdoch number. That is the number that means they came, that's where it came from. Some of this stuff is not, like this came from there. Yeah, so this is the number we're looking for. We have seen shirts with Alex's name in the inside. But it is much calmer. So there are people from all over the country. This is a carpet. This carpet was owned by them. So, um, yeah, I came down and I did the So, you could not bid online. You could only come in person. It is surreal to see. People are taking people no, because we know what comes out of that. But yeah, it's surreal. Are you saying people are taking people been taking selfies and like I'm like, no, uh, like I will look at it. I'm not sitting because if you believe what's true. Which one is it? The left one or the right one? Well, if you look. The left one has more indentation, like a heavier man sat there, than the right one. Mm -hmm. That one looks like more wear than the other one. And then if you look at that chair on the left, that chair on the left has more wear than... The... That's just my theory. Sure, I don't... But if you look at the two, they're vastly different. That's like the Archie Bunker chair on the left. That's my theory. <laughs> so yeah, if you look, that one has way more wear. It was the CNN crew, again, talking. They're like, you're not going to sit? I was like, nope. <laughs> and the news anchor, he was like, I don't disagree with you one bit. <laughs> There's so much stuff, Jen. Like, so you have to kind of pick through, and you have to look for the number 335. 335 is that number... That you're looking for. Excuse me, I'm gonna slip behind you. Okay. So yeah, it depends on if you. Want to pick through everything. So all of this. So again, three, three, five. So they have everything numbered and if it's numbered that means so they've been they've been very transparent that the number 335 was the murdoch stuff like they're not hiding that at all because they do rec like none of this is from the murdochs but like this was mm-hmm well, you know, the um, housekeeper, the housekeeper apparently sold a ton of it on Poshmark. It's, it's surreal to see it all, isn't it? Huh? It's crazy to see it all, isn't it? It is. I've never seen the Oh, I bet not. I bet you haven't seen this many people out at the auction before.
Oh, I agree. 100%. So again, you're looking at that number right there. That is the number that tells you it was Murdoch stuff. I mean, you need a shop back. They had a shop back. these cups. Do you see the cups? like that golf club was theirs. Yep. So like, let me show you this. So like this golf club right here has 335 on it. That is insanity, y'all. Told you, like CNN, when they interviewed me today, I told them it's a story that is just captivating everybody. For some reason, everybody's intrigued by the story. I'll come back over here in a minute. Let's go back. I'm pretty confident. I don't see a sticker on this. This is... All of this is Murdoch stuff. There's the bike. If you did not see it earlier, here's the bike. That when the jury went to Mazelle, if you don't remember, they went and there was a bike out front and people were like, surely that bike hasn't been sitting out there that long. There's the bike. Wow. Again, welcome, welcome. If you've never followed me, be sure to hit that follow button. My name's Corey. I am a local to Savannah that goes live seven days a week on a morning walk. And I bring you guys along. It is. There's the bike. <laughs> it is surreal. Isn't it? Seeing the bike hits differently, doesn't it? I just saw shorts that had Buster's name in them. Oh my gosh. Look. Well, then that's his socks. Look. <laughs> that's wild. Where's that at? Even all their bedding. Over there. All their bedding, all their clothes. I mean, talk about you just think of a family who had everything. everything. All their, I mean, all that. Yep. Oh, I know. Yep. Everywhere that says 335. It is a sad story. It, I mean, it is. If you've been intrigued by this whole event, it is.
Okay, this is not the Murdoch. So if you see 328, means it's not. You know, I don't know. Kim, I have no idea. I mean, I would suspect the ones that are going to sell are going to be something from lot 335. I would definitely suspect that. Let's find the shorts. I would definitely suspect that. Let's find the shorts. Here's Buster Shorts. Yep. Mm -hmm. I have no idea where the other stuff went. There's so much, right? I mean, all the camouflage stuff is up here. And some of it has, you know, Alex's name in it. Again, not everything here is optioned from the Murdochs. Oops, sorry, excuse me. <laughs> potted plants. Maybe he didn't want it. these were owned by the Murdochs. Mm -hmm. And there are things, if you didn't see earlier, there are things with his name in it. So like, let's see where it is. Hold on, let me see if I can get it a better view. Ma'am, oh, you didn't see. I'm good. Have you not seen his name in some of this? Isn't it crazy? Mm -hmm, this is one of them. Do you see the bike? 
from the front of the house, the bicycle. Oh, that's, that's over there. Mm hmm. 335 is the Murdoch clock. Yep. So if you see any. Oh, wait. Yep, it's wait, this one. This one right here. It to be, there's Buster Shorts back there. No, ma'am. Look here, let's pull it out. They won't care. Pull the tag up. Do you see it? No, I still don't see it. You show me. Did I grab the wrong one? You must have. No, right here. Look. Oh, oh, hell yeah. I see it. You know, this is kind of sick. Yeah. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. She is into it. So yeah, I mean, his stuff is here. All of this. But there again, down the road, if you want. Pretty wild, huh? Y'all, it's hot in here. So yeah, I mean, just an insane world. So again, if you're just joining, we're at the auction that is auctioning off a ton of the Murdoch family items. Not all of the stuff here is the Murdochs, but anything that has this number, 335. So everything from the bicycle that was at the front of the house to books, Two clothes with Alex's name. There's some shorts with Buster's name. So there are some wild things here today. TVs. They had. They must have had a hundred TVs. But there are shorts with his name written in them. If you've never followed me, good morning. I do go live seven days a week here and bring you guys along. Did y'all see the shorts with Buster's name in them? Shorts. Mm -hmm, back here. They separate. They're back here. They're in this little weird. You want to? You want me to show? Yeah. It's what you see? Come on. I'll take. <laughs> we'll go on a field trip, kids. A lady told me about it because she was like, "Did you see the shorts?" And I was like, "Where?" She's like, back here. I know, right? Ah. We're going on a field trip, kids. I know. Mm -hmm. So there, now you've seen the shorts. <laughs> Helping the news crew out. Bye, Alyssa. Oops, sorry. Thanks for tuning in. So again, not all of the items belong to the Murdochs. Only the items that have the number 335 are the Murdochs. Which, there's a lot. Where's your beautiful wife? She went to the restaurant. Oh. So all of that. I left a picture. Mm 
-hmm. I mean, that's the question, is how much did he get rid of before he was arrested? Like, all of this is theirs. All of this is theirs. this. So, I mean, it is pretty surreal, isn't it? All right. Let's head out. Let's see what the crowd control is now. So, again, the doors opened at noon, and they said you weren't going to be able to walk around until one. Well, they didn't stop anybody from walking around. And so, you just kind of came in, and you could walk around. You didn't even have to register. The auction begins at 4 o'clock. I'm not bidding on anything. I just wanted to come over and see all the items. So, yeah. They started at... They start auctioning at 4. And then... Yeah. Yeah. Pretty surreal, huh? So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this random day. What's Belfair? What is Belfair? Does anybody know? Can somebody look that up for me? That's a subscriber, so I can see your response. What is Belfair? Is that a country club? Because, see, they don't have numbers on here, so I don't know if these were... I think they were Murdoch's cars. Nope. Pretty wild. Let's see what license plates we see. So we met people from Virginia. A Coney, that's a good drive from here. I'm looking to see what license plates we see. So Virginia, Atlanta. Pretty wild, huh? So you can now, the traffic, it is definitely getting a little busier. South Carolina. So it is definitely getting a little busier than it was prior to us getting here. Or like when it opened. Yep, I think so. So I for sure have a ton of content though, I'll tell you that to create and post. Ooh, it is hot, y'all. Gracious. So, if you've never followed me, hit, it's a golf club. Okay, so if it's a golf club, that is their cars. Um, my battery's almost dead because I had not planned for this event today. If it's the golf, that's the golf and country club that they went to then. So, there you go. If you've never followed me before. Oh, I guess I do need to dance, don't I? Because we did hit. Whew. Hold on, I got to cool off and let my phone charge for a few minutes. Because the phone about to straight up. And I'm scared to sit my phone out on my car. Because it is hot, guys. And it will smother. But we do need to dance because we did hit a thousand. Let me go farther down. Let me see if I can find some shade because y'all, my phone is like sitting target right now. There goes CNN. CNN's saying peace out. So if you didn't follow me earlier, if you weren't on here earlier, I did get interviewed by CNN. I got filmed by WJCL. I got filmed by somebody else. I don't really know who all I got filmed by. But ding dang. And that was a pretty 
Yeah, 5.15, 5.30, we'll do back porch chat. That was a pretty, um, pretty big interview with, the, with um, CNN. Hold up. I can think I can do it here. That'll be good. Because I'm trying to save the sanctity of people, too, in this. So that was a pretty amazing interview by CNN that I got. I'm about to set you up because we did hit a new lot, like a new goal of 30. What are we at now? So we are at 37.8. So we could hit 38 today. That's pretty crazy. All right. Let me set you guys up on the gimbal now. Where's the, oh, there it is. Hold up. So you can say now that you went to the auction. We did have over 2,000 people in the live at one point today. That was pretty crazy. I really, I'm going to say this. I'm a little shocked that I was the... Okay, are we back? Now let's dance. Um, so I'm really surprised though that I was the only streamer here. I mean, that was pretty dang crazy. All right, let me set you guys up and we'll dance. Because we hit a new goal. I did have to turn to subscription only chat during this live because we were just so overwhelmed with people. Hold on, I gotta let all these. Okay, so here we were. Let me pull you around. So there we are. We are at, if you didn't know, we were at the auction for the Murdochs. We went around, walked around, saw everything. In the process, we did hit a new following, a new goal. So we are going to dance because we did hit 37,000. We're actually pretty close to 38,000, honestly. So if you never follow me, hit that follow. has been a crazy afternoon so I hope that you enjoyed we will be live for back porch chat again we are at Liberty auction that is where the Murdoch family items are being auctioned off got lots of content in this live that I'll be posting so if you haven't followed me before, definitely hit that follow button. We have definitely danced all over the place. Thank you for the whole lot of followers, a thousand followers in this live that we just got. My name's Corey. I do go live seven mornings a week here in beautiful Savannah, Georgia. So if you've never followed me, let me in introduce myself again. Hello, my name is Corey. I am a local to Savannah. I do go live seven days a week here in beautiful Savannah. Well, we're actually in Pembroke right now, but in Savannah, we go live seven mornings a week starting at 8 a.m. If you've never followed me, be sure to hit that follow button. Thank you. Oh, and let me do my song. We represent the Corey crew, the Corey crew, the Corey crew. We represent the Corey crew. So all of you who subscribed during this live, thank you. Go check out my content. I've got content when we were at the courthouse. I got content all over. So this is about 30 minutes from Savannah, where we came in Pembroke, Georgia. If you haven't seen all the content before or all of it, definitely check it out.
Woo, what a day, folks. What a day. Thank you for all the subscriptions. And I'll be live for Back Porch Chat at about 5.15 to 5.30. So y'all have a great afternoon and I'll see you soon. Bye.